known for a long time. She's a business manager for a wrestler. And what do you think of her? The lady was charming, beautiful, and it may seem a little indelicate of me to say it, but don't you think that she's here? That's not to fight. Huh? I'm sure of it. <laughs>
thinking about that idea of yours, Captain. This land here is a fragment of our prehistoric world. And I... Well, I'm inclined to think that maybe you might be right. Oh, you accepted my theory. Except for one thing. Now, a comet travels at hundreds of miles per second, right? True. Well, then how could it smash into the Earth, pick up a vast area of land as neatly as a man scooping out a piece of mill, and yet not shatter everything into dust? I don't know exactly, but the Earth moves in orbit around the Sun. It also spins in its polar axis. Perhaps both motions coincided with the course of the comet. And the Earth rolled with a blow like a boxer taking a hard punch, huh? Yes, something like that. And I see. I don't believe they are going to separate.
think you're thinking of Columbo. We'll get up close and personal with some cave people soon in this film, and you'll probably want to get up close and personal with cave woman Dina. Hey, baby. Uh, well, she's a former Playboy centerfold, Joan Staley, whose career we've discussed before when she played Alma in Don Knotts' Ghost and Mr. Chicken. Are you scared? Are you chicken? What? Oh, more like a ghost. Another Kate Cutie is Natita, played by Danielle Demet, who did movies like Peter Sellers' The Party and Return of the Fly, and TV shows like I Dream of Jeannie and Man from Uncle. Hello, Nana. Uncle. Caveman Alu has played a caveman before. He's Greg Martell, who was the wacky. Neanderthal and Dinosaurus, and among our other cavemen, we have Patu. <laughs> Just Patu is fine. He's I stand for Jolly, a veteran of cowboy films and TV shows like Gunsmoke and Bonanza, and his last movie role was in the giant bunny rabbit movie Night of the Leapers, which was directed by his son Stan. Don't think Stan was that fuzzy. Also among the cavemen is Anoka. He's Mike Lane, who wrestled in the 50s as Tarzan Mike, worked with Humphrey Bogart in The Harder They Fall, and was in Frankenstein 1970 with Boris Karloff. And he also played the Frankenstein monster on The Monkees, as well as Frank Enstein in the Saturday morning TV series Monster Squad. He looks pretty good for a dead guy. Some big names appear as lookalikes for our main cast in some of the stock footage from 1 million B.C. Lon Chaney Jr., subs for Patu. Carol Landis is in there for Dina. And as Hector, we glimpse Victor Mature. I'm not a children. I'm all grown up. I said you were mature. Liberty Mutual Insurance. Liberty stands with you. A match. Hawkeye in the 4077 made standing up to authority just what the doctor ordered. Watch Match. Weeknights at 7, 6 Central on 